The Mekong River has been a major transportation channel in the sub-region for a long time. In the dry season, the water level is very low and submerged rocks are unveiled, which makes it difficult for large ships to pass. Understanding this, Zayawuri Hydroelectric Power Plant includes a navigation lock built with engineering excellence to allow ships to pass through the project year-round. This will result in enhanced economic and social development in the Mekong sub-region. The navigation lock extends over a total of 12 meters in width and 700 meters in length. When completed, it will be able to accommodate two of 500 deadweight ton ships at a time. For upstream transport, ships from downstream, where water levels are lower, will move into the lower lock chamber. After the boat has entered the lower lock chamber, the downstream miter gate will close, and water will be fed from the upstream into the lock to raise the water level up to the same height as in the upper lock chamber. Once the water levels are equalized, the middle miter gate will be opened to allow ships to pass into the upper lock chamber. Then this gate will be closed and the water level in the upper lock chamber will once again rise to the same level as the water in the reservoir before the upstream miter gate is opened to let the ship exit into the reservoir and further upstream. In contrast, when ships are heading downstream, both the middle and downstream miter gates will be closed and the upstream miter gate open to allow ships to enter into the upper lock chamber. Then the water from the upper lock chamber will be released into the lower lock chamber until an equal water level has been reached between both chambers to ensure that ships can smoothly proceed to the lower lock chamber. The water in the lower lock chamber will then be adjusted to the same level as tail water before the downstream miter gate is open the ships can move out of the lock. This process will increase water transport convenience and efficiency to strengthen the economic health and social development of communities along the lower Mekong River area. This spillway plays a major role in ensuring that the safety of a runoff river power station by safely routing any access water, which is not used to generate electricity, across the plant and into the downstream tailwater. This is an essential requirement since in a run of river plant, by definition, the total outflow of water going through the power plant equals the inflow of water, thus ensuring no alterations or adverse impact up on the communities along the river bank and ecological systems. The spillway consists of a total of 11 gates, 7 radial gates of the surface spillway, and 4 low-level outlet gates for sediment management. All gates can be raised up or lowered individually to control the water level upstream of the plant in order to optimize electricity generation. Meanwhile, sedimentation in the upstream river pondage can be released when needed. The stilling basin is located downstream of the radial gates to dissipate the energy of the water before being released into the natural river course downstream of the project. This will prevent erosion of the river banks and any other impact on the downstream environment. Zayaburi Hydroelectric Power Plant is located on the Lower Mekong River. Built based on the run of river concept, it has an intermediate block between the powerhouse and spillway. Upstream water flows naturally into the powerhouse and turns the water turbines using the natural water pressure caused by the different water levels, which is also called the head. The power is generated by generators directly connected to the moving turbines. The generated electricity is then distributed by the 115 kV and 500 kV transmission system. The project has a total capacity of 1,285 megawatts, generated by seven large turbines of 175 megawatt capacity and one smaller turbine of 60 megawatts. The project produces and transmits the electricity per year and sends to Thailand and Lao PDR 
for domestic use through the transmission system. The Yaburi Hydroelectric Power Plant shows the fish-friendly Kaplan turbines, specially designed to have fewer blades and slower rotation. Every part of the turbine was specially designed to allow fish to pass throughout the project safe and sound. Fish is a very precious resource in the Mekong River Basin. In order to facilitate the migration of fish, both downstream and upstream migration, The downstream fish migration system also uses the water control technique that allows fish to migrate all year round. Fish can enter into the fish resting pool through a multiple openings fish collecting gallery on the north of the power plant. Special gates open and the fish can migrate downstream through a gentle slope chute which release fish unharmed into the tail race water. The electricity generating turbines are also specifically designed to be fish friendly. This includes the choice of a horizontal axial turbine with fewer blades and lower rotational speed. The very small gaps between the blades and the housing also ensure higher rate of survival for the fish. To further enhance the livelihood of the fishing communities along the Mekong River, Sayaburi Hydroelectric Power Plant sets up a fishery management unit to breed and restocking the Mekong River with the fish species of high economic and ecological value.